question two of the summer 2012 physics unit one foundation paper this is all to do with ionizing radiations first part of the question gives you some information about the idea that a radioactive source emits three types of ionizing radiation alpha beta and gamma complete the sentence by putting a cross in the box next to the answer next to your answer radioactive sources emit radiation and the answer that's most applicable here is all the time so we're going to put a cross in that box there aren't any intervals it, it, it isn't about it being every few minutes or only in physical processes such as heating don't have any effect on the, how radiation is emitted the point is it is all the time the next question is testing our understanding of what those three sources alpha beta and gamma are all about and how they're made up it gives one example here alpha radiation is a particle and it transfers energy beta radiation is also a particle it's actually an electron so it's a negatively charged tiny particle but it does transfer energy gamma we should recognize because it's part of the electromagnetic spectrum it is a type of light high energy light so it travels as a wave and it does transfer energy all of these types of radiations transmit energy state two uses of gamma radiation well there are many uses but the most common that most people would recognize would be detecting cancer um, it could be treating cancer and also sterilization of could be food or medical equipment that would be two marks any two, one mark for each. Stars can emit gamma, ray, uh, gamma waves and light waves. Gamma waves and light waves are both parts of the electromagnetic spectrum. Explain why it takes the same time for both of these waves to travel from the star to a space telescope. Well the key idea is here is that they will both travel at the same speed the speed of light. That's one mark and crucially in a vacuum or alternatively we could say in space. Space is a vacuum. A vacuum is a space where there's, there's no other uh, matter to interfere with the travelling of the, the, of the waves and so that is the fastest possible speed um, so one mark for that and that gives us the full two marks.